All right, so we're looking at the spinal cord, and um, this is the anterior side because it has the bigger crack than this side, which is the posterior side. And I'm going to go in order of our list. So first we have the posterior median sulcus. Then we have the anterior median fissure. This. Then we have our central canal. Then we have our dorsal column, which would be this, and this, and our ventral column would be this, and this, ventral column. Then we have our posterior horn, which is thin. And then we have our anterior horn, which is a little bit fatter than the posterior horn. So this is our anterior horn. Then we have our lateral horns, which is that and that on both sides. So the lateral horn. Then we have the pia mater, which would be this outside portion. And it'll be all the way around. And it'll be the pink outside part is the pia mater. Then we have the dora mater, which is this blue outside portion. And then we have the arachnoid matter, which will be this gray lining all the way around. And then we have the subarachnoid trabeculae, which will be this gray that's all the way around. The subarachnoid trabeculae, trabecula. Then we have our epidural space, which will be the space all outside of the spinal cord would be the epidural space. The subdural space would be, be, so this is the dural space, and this is the, I mean, this is the dural, dura matter, and this is the arachnoid matter. And in between, it would be the subdural space. And then right here, this black is our subarachnoid space. And then we come to the side, we have this ligament called the denticulate ligament. And then we have our dorsal root, because it's on the posterior side, and our ventral root. And if you cut away at this, then you have the this yellow part, which is our do dorsal root ganglion. And that's our spinal cord.